guys. Giant space bugs. How you get so big to do food of this kind? Hey guys, I'm here to review the Nest Book 2 in the Adventures in Wild Space series. If you are unfamiliar with the Adventures in Wild Space series, go ahead and click up on the card that's going to appear on the screen. It's going to take you to my review of the first book, uh, just so you're not lost. So this is book two, and if you did watch my first video, you might be a little bit confused because I talked about two stories last time. The escape is technically book zero, and the snare is book one. So here we are on The Nest by Tom Huddleston. He is the other author. The other books were written by Kevin Scott. And yeah, I really like this book. This is everything I wanted a book in this series to be. When I first heard the title Adventures in Wild Space for the series, I wanted weird, strange adventures out in uncharted space. And that's what I got. So the main characters, Milo and Lena, are off still trying to steal their parents back from the Empire and they end up on a planet with a lot of really strange wildlife and one really big scary bug. And it was a great story. It was a Star Wars creature feature. It was a couple of kids palling around with hunters in a jungle. Like it was, it was fun. I love this kind of thing where it's just Star Wars being its own thing and not having to fit into this grand structure. Now the series as a whole does have an overarching plot and I don't want to slam that. I'm also really enjoying the full plot of the series. I just think it's fun when they take advantage of doing this kind of side adventure as well. And it gives you time to get to know the main characters and really come to care about them as opposed to just following them all in the immediate plot. The personalities of the two main kids continue to grow. I like seeing Milo kind of come into his own. He has his own set of skills. He has his own set of knowledge, which is really great. Lena is kind of falling into this category of, you know, she's too young to really have to take care of her brother, but she's being forced to anyway, and it's causing her to grow up really fast. I really have enjoyed watching them and how they interact with each other and just how they grow with each other. And as always, there's just really amazing pictures scattered throughout the book that just add a lot of personality. Join me soon where we will review the heist, the third book in Adventures in Wild Space. We're going to be going to a planet that's somewhat familiar to, uh, to a lot of Star Wars fans and I'm really excited to get there. Till next time, keep it real and fly casual. Cooking can be fun.